The DJs had not yet settled on Ibiza and already the first challenge was on. Oof, I'm a little bit nervous. Some thought they were already kicked out. I was telling him, cut it off, the time, cut it off. And he was like, no, sorry, I know I was not so good, I have to go home. And I was, no, you don't have to go home. Just stop the music, please. But the competition is just starting. Who is the first winner of the boot camp? So the proud winner is... Henrik. He had the most natural flow, the best selection of music, so he definitely had the most outstanding performance yesterday. So I'm really, really excited that I won this first challenge. It turned out great. The trophy of yesterday's challenge is a choker card, so you can use this one to stay away from one of the competition if you want to. Right now I feel I don't want to skip any, I just want to join all, all the challenges. They have to understand that this is a unique chance given to them from Bern and they should not mess that up. For some, it was not easy to accept the defeat. I'm so sad because I'm not the winner. But that is the drill of the boot camp. Last year's finalist, Miss Soulfly, understands that better than anyone. She was devastated not to have won, and now she's sharing her unexpected success with the rookie DJs. And my whole world collapsed completely. My heart was broken. I was so sad I could cry now even when I think of that. Marina was hungry for success and Byrne didn't let it go unnoticed. Today she has a residency in one of the best clubs in Ibiza. This passion I think uh, that I have, that all the Burn guys from last year felt something in me, I think you all need to have this. Be patient and put everything you have into this if you want to make it, of course. I, don't know, I got goosebumps like 10 times when she was speaking because I had like, the same feelings. Same kind of emotions and passion. Be silent, be still and do your stuff and enjoy your stay on the island. Enjoy your chance to get all the connections and all the networking you can have here because this is really a melting point of electronic music. So be happy if you get anything here. Even though you're not going to win the competition, you still have a chance of coming here, living here in the whole season, become a resident at some club because of networking. That's cool. I wish you all the luck. Cheers for you guys. Pressure is back on because the next challenge is about to start. The DJs have to bring their music on USBs and that is all they know. So what I want you is to put the USB stick in here. Of course. <laughs> I have to use record box and someone else music on top of it. Kill me. This should be a situation such that you come to the gig with a USB stick and it gets broken. And the only way to, to continue is to use the USB stick from the DJ before. I cannot believe I pull out the USB from Japanese guy. There were like two uh, tracks and some loops, uh, short, short stuff and everything. That's the drill. You just need to know how to behave in, in those situations. I got uh, Jose's uh, USB with uh, some deep house. It's good for me. It was very, very difficult for me. I got uh, USB stick was absolutely the wrong music style. Maybe I can win this second day. I hope so. And we will see. Generally, uh, again, I'm just gonna name the one who were really outstanding, like in a positive and a negative side. I was a little bit disappointed that some really didn't know the basics about the setup, which is a general setup being used on 99% of the events nowadays. And I'm curious what the future will bring.